Hey everybody, it's Jay. Um, I've got my robot working better now. Uh, he is definitely walking. You can see. Um, I also have the sensors hooked up. He has some uh, crude um, object uh, recognition or some collision avoidance there. He has an ultrasonic range finder on the front. I'm calling him Clyde now. He has the ultrasonic range finder basically uses ping or sonar to detect uh, how far the objects are directly in front of it. When it sees something within a certain range, it'll turn around. I'm finding that I need extra range finders on so it has some peripheral vision. Uh, but it does kind of make a decision about which way to turn uh, using the photoresistors which are on the front. Well, it knows that there's something in front of it. It just doesn't know how to get around it right now. See, he detected those balls, and he's going to try to go around. Oh, more obstacles. Here he comes. Oh, he detected the bumper. He's turning around. Oh, detected the other bumpers. Oh, more bumpers. And turning around. I do have this problem where the legs fall out of sync if he turns at strange angles. So I've got to find a way uh, for the legs to sync back up when he's done turning. And I need to improve the overall uh, peripheral vision uh, so that he can clear his legs. He doesn't know when his legs are colliding with objects around, so wider peripherals, I think, would um, enable him to uh, detect that his legs are going to knock falls or other obstacles. All right. Well, I hope you like that. I'll see you all soon. Bye.